I mean, that's it's because you're absolutely right. It seems that they're just doing what they want to do, and they don't build that emotional muscle that you talk about. I've heard you speak about uh, emotional muscle. So essentially, what you're talking about is a person who is forcing himself to take these recovery actions, or the one, the ones that are going to develop this uh, this strong resistance. Talk a little bit about that, if you would. Well, the only way that you can uh, address this this momentum, this negative psychic energy in which recovery and relapse is basically one and the same without a qualitative difference is to understand that by teaching or educating the addict or alcoholic to go against what they feel is how you get that distinction just like I pointed out in that chart previously and it is through this way that it is very helpful person to take their what I believe is oppositional defined rebellious natures and, and turn it from a liability into a complete asset and absolutely be able to change their life. I see that. You know, the, the, you talk about the deviations and actually they can use that, you know, because really it's, it's you, you, if you let it be a character defect, it's a character defect. If you use it to your advantage, now it's, now it's you know, a strong character trait. It's very interesting, Jerry. Very interesting. Yes, indeed. it is.